Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, my name is Gabriella. In today's video, I will be drawing a cat with watercolor pencils in my Fabriano 1264 watercolor sketchbook. I haven't used this sketchbook for several weeks at this point. I've mostly been drawing on loose sheets of paper lately, but I do want to fill this up eventually. It's very satisfying to fill up a sketchbook. The reference picture was taken by my sister on her summer vacation in Croatia. My family members usually send me a lot of photos from their travels so that I can use them in my art, which is much appreciated. This is the pouch I use for storing my Karen Dash Museum Aquarelle pencils. This is all I have from the range. As you can see, I don't have too many. I started out by getting the landscape set which consisted of 20 nature-themed colors. Then I went and bought a couple of more open stock because some basic colors were missing. I also bought some pastel shades in addition, as pastel shades were not included in my other watercolor pencil sets. I still don't have all the colors that I prefer to have in a set, but I think I will eventually invest in some more pencils. These watercolor pencils are very expensive, by the way. In fact, they are so pricey that I was not gonna get a full set by any means. However, it is true that you get what you pay for, and I have to say that these are some of the best watercolor pencils that I have ever tried in my life. They are rich and pigmented, have a soft lead, which is my preference when buying colored pencils. They fully dissolve in water and mix really well. You definitely don't need the full range to create quality art with them. Also, most of these pigments have a very high light fastness, so they are suitable for creating professional art as well. As far as I'm concerned, light fastness is not a huge deal for me as I don't sell my art. The biggest selling point for me in these pencils is the pigmentation and the soft lead. I have a couple of new watercolor pencil videos coming up that I've been working on lately. You can also expect some ink tense videos coming soon, so if you're interested, please stay tuned. Anyways, that's it from me for now. I hope you will enjoy this speed paint. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more. I will see you again soon. Bye!